Great. So again, staying with that same litter here, the 31 litter, we have lot five, which is a 31.6 guild, and lot six, which is 31.8 guild. Again, these are hibachis, uh, the popular red boar there at upper hand, and then a backdraft sow that originated from JJ Genetics uh, from the Busco firm uh, there in the state up north. Uh, Jade is uh, showing you lot five, which is uh, 31.6. 31 6 is uh, just a really good, really good balance, good design, good footed, real functional kind of a guilt. This is one of those guilts that I think you can uh, kind of put the hammer down uh, on her and get her rolling. Again, these hibachis that are a little greener when they get started usually end up feeding and, and going on and being, uh, you know, really good uh, kinds of show guilts. Then I think the upside of this guilt as well is, is the opportunity that you've got there of being a sow because she's a little longer fronted, she's a little taller and a little more upright in her elevation. Uh, and just really good about her, her feet and legs and the way she hits the surface. Uh, one of our favorites uh, out of the group has been uh, the 31-8 uh, gilt, which is lot six. I think this is kind of the combination gilt. This is the widest chested gilt in the litter. This is the gilt that probably has a little more of that bear a look if that's what you're into and what you like. Uh, this is the one that I think out of the litter would probably jackpot early and often on uh, the Ohio Circuit, uh, the Buckeye Bash and some of those other shows that are coming up pretty quick. And then she's in early June, so again, I think you could go on to Georgia, but I like this gilt's uh, stoutness and feature that she has up front, but yet she's still pretty. Uh, I like her length out of her hip and, and just the way that she uses her hind legs. So again, that's a good pair of gilts as well. Lot 5 is 31 Lot 6 is 31-8. Again, they're hibachi backdraft.